Hello and welcome to today's tutorial on Nero Platinum 15. Today we're going to look at Nero Record. So I'm going to select the icon for Nero Platinum 15 and I'm going to click and I'm brought to this screen and I'm going to select Nero Record Thumbnail and I'm going to click and we're brought to this screen. I'm going to choose to work on a video file and so I highlight import video files and I click and I've pre-selected to work on this project so I'm going to click on the thumbnail and that will import that file into this screen and when the thumbnail changes I can work on it now I'm going to choose to make this file play once again on a Samsung device and I'm going to choose a Samsung device for it to play on and I'm further going to edit this file so I'm going to choose edit video and I'm brought to this screen and I'm going to play that video by coming to the bottom middle of the screen and pressing on the play icon. So I'm going to edit this video and I'm just going to click on the timeline so that I have something on the screen to see and I should be able to play from about that point. That's where I want to start to edit this video so I'm going to come up to the top left hand side and I'm going to click on crop and this gives me the ability to readjust the size of the video by getting hold of this little round symbol on the screen left clicking and I can drag that area around the screen I can get hold of the opposite side and move that in can get hold of the bottom and I can move that up and when I'm happy with the framing that I have then I could play that video just to see how that image pans out so I'm going to press play to copy all of this video I only want the part where the boat is turning so I come across to the trim tool and I click on the trim tool and you notice that it's given me information here it's telling me the duration of the video and when it starts and when it ends now I can use this to move these little icons along the timeline or more simply, I can get hold of those little icons and click, hold and move them along. And it's from roughly about there on the timeline that I want to start to copy this video from. And I don't want to go to the very end, so I get hold of this symbol on the timeline bottom right, left click and drag back to where I'm happy with the image and I think that's what I like so I'm just going to play that part of the video and it will only now play the blue part of the timeline so I click play <laughs> that I want to copy and if I then click OK 
it will only then copy the, this part of the timeline and the highlighted part of the video. So I'm going to click OK and I'm brought back to this screen. I have more options with this editing tool and I'm going to go to the more option drop down and I'm going to click and it's going to then allow me to change the audio of this video by coming to this more settings icon and by clicking on that I can check this box and then I can reduce or increase the volume. I don't want to do that, I'm happy with the volume so I'm going to exit out of this drop down and furthermore I could come across to this side, this quality side of the screen and I could change the quality from the recommended setting to a better or a worse quality and that would change the file size but I'm happy with the quality that I'm going to get on that setting so I'm going to come across to the bottom right hand side and if I click on the, the OK symbol I'm brought to this screen and we have the job in a queue and I'm going to then come to where it says start encoding on the bottom right hand side of the screen and I'm going to click on that part of the screen and it's going to encode that video file to play on the Samsung device. It's finished. I could play that video by pressing play to check what I've got or I could see where it has stored this video on the system so I'm going to click on browse and that's the video there and to play it I simply have to click on that icon and that would play. So I'm going to do that has been shortened in length and we've cropped the image in so that we can see more of the detail of the boat and I hope that you've learnt something from this video and I look forward to seeing you next time. By the way I'm using something called carts and you'll notice that a symbol will appear on the top right hand side of this video and by clicking on that you'll be taken to a playlist and you'll be able to see more of these videos from that playlist. Thank you for watching and I look forward to seeing you next time.